why is it South Asians more at risk? Research show that their healthy BMI is actually different to a normal person's BMI and they should actually stay on the leaner side of things. For South Asians, Chinese and Japanese and Southeast Asian, you sort of want to be in the BMI less than 23 to be considered a healthy range. So when you get to 24, 25, you're actually already in the overweight category, right? Whereas Caucasians is 25 and above. Really? Southeast Asian, you want to be 27. So over 27 would be considered obese. The risks that we see in the obese category that come with 30 and above for Caucasians start happening sooner and earlier in BMI 27 range for these populations. Genetics plays a huge role. Reality is we should be telling South Asians, look, we need to actually stay lighter than our Caucasian counterparts. And we need to try and stay more muscled as, as much as we can as well, because we know muscle is such a good sink for things like glucose as well. And it helps with kind of energy metabolism. South Asians were the worst fat oxidizers than the other races, which is quite interesting. We've got the cards stacked against us in some way. So we have to work a bit harder as well and be aware of those risks.